There was blood everywhere. Mauled by his own dogs, an Oklahoma man now struggling to survive after a vicious attack. He's actually worsened since yesterday. Mm. A dog's owner suffering serious injuries to his arms and legs. Investigators are still not releasing his name until his family is notified. But tonight we're hearing from a deputy who got to the man moments after that 911 call came in. She sat down with News Force Kaylee Olivas. Turning on their own owner, two dogs mauled a Tecumseh man yesterday morning, leaving behind a pretty gruesome scene. Now he's at OU Medical fighting for his life. A 911 call came in just before a 30 Monday morning of an animal attack. Pottawatomie County Deputy Amber Soul getting there minutes later, only to find a bloody mess. There was a white car there that was covered in blood. Um, I grabbed my tourniquet kit and attempted to start trying to get a tourniquet or gauze something to try to stop some bleeding. But before she could do that, Deputy Soul says one of the two pit bulls tried going after her. It was barking at me. Um, it got within just a few feet of me. The witnesses that were in their vehicle, they're screaming at me, don't get out of the car. That, I mean, this dog is very vicious. Once I realized that it was going to be to where I had to you know, shoot the dog, that's I shot it. Both dogs then took off into the woods nearby, allowing Deputy Soul to begin life-saving treatment. But the man's injuries were so severe, he had to be airlifted to OU Health in Oklahoma City. He is in life-threatening, um, has life-threatening injuries and in critical condition. Um, he's actually worsened since yesterday. Um, possibility of having surgeries. This case is still under investigation, but should be finalized no later than early next week. In Pottawatomie County, Kaylee Olivas, Oklahoma's News 4. The two dogs on the loose are male and female, black with a white triangle on their chest. If you see either, do not approach them and call 911.